A Brexit deal is set to be struck with the EU at the 59 minute of the 11th hour as negotiations reach a crucial moment. Alistair Jack, Secretary of State for Scotland told Express in an interview today this week, was the week for a deal to be secured. The thorny issues of fishing rights and the level playing field aimed at preventing unfair competition on standards and state subsidies remain the major obstacles to an agreement. But this publication has learned a deal could be secured by the end of this week as talks between Lord Frost and Michel Barnier continue. In an exclusive interview with this website, he said, we've had for a quite a long time now that this is the week. But I genuinely think that this is the week. The clock is ticking for a deal to be ratified because we are ending the transition period on December 31st so I do genuinely think this is the week to get a deal done. With the EU historically, it's always been at the 59th minute at the 11th hour and I think we've reached that. If they are prepared to respect our sovereignty having left the EU and to respect the sovereignty of our coastal waters, then I hope there is a deal to be done. I really hope there is a deal to be done, it's as much for them as for us. Mr Jack stressed the UK spent €100 billion Euros more than Brussels spent with us on trade making clear, it was in their interests, to have a good trading relationship. He continued, also, we have to recognize our nearest trading partner and we should have a trade deal with our nearest trading partner if at all possible. But it has to be on the basis of respect and respect for sovereignty. Mr Jack concluded, I think we can after 45 years of being closely aligned, we should be able to have a deal and I am hopeful we can achieve that this week. The negotiating teams are expected to find a compromise on the fishing and level playing field disputes within days. But very little time will be left for a deal to go through the ratification process with votes expected in both the UK and European parliaments over the coming weeks. Fishing alone contributed just 0.03% of British economic output in 2019 but is seen as a staple industry in the UK which needed to be preserved. Combined with fish and shellfish processing, the sector makes up 0.1% of UK GDP. Britain wants zonal attachment to agree a total allowable catch for the UK waters.